Ade. So Ade is the one that got me into NCT. Well, she basically got me into everything, <laughs> but specifically NCT. That was the group that she was like, you have to do it. Yeah. Like no escape, you have to do this. <laughs> Since you are an N, is it N citizen? I'm an N citizen, Since yes. Since you are an N citizen, I thought it only makes sense for you to review this album with me. Yeah, and it is a really big deal because- Yeah, you've been talking about it for a long time. I have. Even though I didn't know stuff and I wasn't that into it, you've been like- I've been hyping it up yeah. a lot. There's a lot of reasons for this. One, NCT 127 is the subunit that got me into NCT as a whole. So they're a big deal. They're a big deal to me. Yeah. And they haven't had a comeback for a year and six months. So, yeah. Ooh. It's been a long time since Neozone. So this has been highly anticipated. Okay. Like even their pre-orders. That's why they're out here doing so many photos. <laughs> Yeah, they I'm went so hard. Confused. They went hard with the promo. They had okay. so many like promotional like yeah. videos, pictures. They even had like a sitcom. They broke the record for like pre-orders. They had like yeah, two point one two like million pre-orders. So they've been killing it. So everyone's been anticipating this album. I've heard it, I'm gassed. I can't wait for you to hear it all the way through as well. Yeah, so I've listened to five five or four songs from it but i think um a few of them are actually just snippets yeah from like a kind of collaboration that they a compilation that they did so it's my first listen it's her review and it's kind of interesting that we're doing the two yeah together so that's going to be fun from an end citizen to a i don't know like admirer <laughs> play the track <laughs> So this is the part where I wasn't sure about yeah. yeah. But that part... Oh, <laughs> that part sounded a bit like, um, was it Cherry Bomb? What? Uh, when they're coming in? Yeah. What? With his rap? No, 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 no. Okay, let me or just back. Okay. Okay. It's this. I'll show you. That, oh no. That. To me, that sounded like Cherry Bomb. Oh, I get what you mean. But this part took me some time to get used to. Yeah, see. Okay. What? The first time I heard Sticker Right was 6 a.m. in the morning <laughs> on the 17th yeah, of September. Was so I was gas. I woke up early. I don't even know. My body just woke up and was like. <laughs> It's the day of the comeback. I don't know. But um, I listened to it at 6am and I can't lie. Like the first half of that song, like that intro that part, and like Taeyong yeah. coming in, was it was a lot for me to digest at 6am in the morning because I did feel like, wait a minute, what's this weird sound? like? When I first heard it, on? I felt like it wasn't supposed to be there. <laughs> Honestly, until, well, literally like a few seconds later, then it's like, ah, oh, Okay, yeah, it all makes sense. It did make it sense makes after sense. a while, but the first time you hear it, it is jarring because you just feel like, why is this like broken recorder sound playing in my ear? Like, I was so confused. I wasn't really sure if it was on beat when they were coming in. Yeah, or off beat. that's what it was. It was throwing me off a lot. Like, it felt like it was in construction still. <laughs> so that's why I was like, okay, but then it fits. And then it makes sense yeah. that they... Now that you've heard it like a few times and I've heard it like quite a lot, I, I actually get it, twice, it now. But yeah, it makes sense. Yeah. Let's, let's go back. It's this part, it's about to yeah. like, fit. Now it's making sense. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is the bit where I was like, yeah, I like this. But that line, that line is something. I'm sorry, but don't worry, just trust me. Only you can... Do you know, do you know what that is? And when he came out saying that, like, 
Don't worry. Just trust me. <laughs> what is that? Look, you just got all the girls screaming. Honestly. No, but I actually feel like with this song, like when they're all like going back and forth with the pre-chorus and just with the beat being really dramatic and different to yeah, like yeah. the verse, it actually gives a sense of like anticipation, like, okay, what's the next person gonna yeah, say? True, like, true, true. And I like that. And I feel like I've just been transported to like BBC proms. You know, like when they <laughs> I just kept doing this because it felt like okay. like an orchestra. I don't know, like dun 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 dun. dun. I don't know. It just feels like a classical <laughs> instrumental. I don't know, but if you don't know about BBC Proms, get to know, get cultured. But um, <laughs> it does feel like mm -hmm. that. Like yeah. You want it, it's yours. Yeah! The way to answer sticker. Yes, You know that I ain't falling off. That's a shimmy, so good chilling. Who put the sound again? He always sounds like he's, um, what's it called? Like with his voice, he's mixing records. You know, like a DJ. You know, oh, when a DJ like scratches. Yeah. yeah. When a DJ scratches, Mark's doing that with his voice. Look, I'm not gonna lie, for Mark to be able to rap on beat to this kind of beat is talent. <laughs> like I don't know how he's finding his place to even flow with this but he did and I'm here for it because it just shows that whatever you throw at him he's gonna flow and he's gonna flow well like it's you're gonna be bopping to his rap like ah, okay. but just the way he shifts up his voice it's like wow yeah, I love it I like he, it. He always understands me. Vocal runs. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's the one doing the yeah, yeah, yeah? Is that Taeyeon? Utah. Oh, it's like no, it is Taeyong. Yeah. But this lyric, that lyric that John Woe does. Yeah, you treat me like a boy, like a grown up child chasing a dream. Oh. <laughs> I mean, you're trying... <laughs> oh, my days. Like, when I first heard that lyric, oh, <laughs> John Woe, okay. He's, he's really just jumping up in my estimation, like the new guy. Because for me, the new guy, <laughs> he was in Kick It. You've seen Kick It. He was right there. He was in Chernobyl. Was he in Chernobyl? No. Okay, okay. I feel better at least. <laughs> um, I just, well, I, <laughs> I have no excuse for why I didn't <laughs> realize. And kick, kick It's a lot. Okay, Kick It's a lot. Yeah. And there's a lot of them. We did that a long time ago, so it's fair. Like. Yeah, that one I I didn't see. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I didn't see him. But in the discovery, I heard his voice and I was like, whoa. Yeah. Okay. Like his vocals were really, like it's the way he said it with like kind of a grunt. It was it was nice. But also just his visuals, like the way he presents himself. Like oh yeah, it's visually just... he snapped this comeback. Definitely, it just fit the whole package. For yeah, me, but like he yeah. knows what he's doing. When do we get a solo? Oh, <laughs> oh we need it. Oh, she can with the falsetto. <laughs> and the way they're delicate yeah. about it. The growl. The growl. Oh, where are you pausing? You're <laughs> the growl, right? Hetchan growling. No, Why? I know, I know. And for what? Um, for what? Just to demonstrate desperation. So you I get it. I've seen Hetchan in Dream. And so this Hetchan for me is. 
it's a different. whole new level. This, de- this Hetchen is quite different. Wow. No, I don't know why he had to growl. No. Nah, he snatched everything. Oh, 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 did I miss it? Yeah. He literally came in with a growl. There was no need for it. It wasn't necessary. Could have just gone with the same. The vocalists. Like vocal <laughs> <laughs> Let's throw a party just for the two of us. Ooh. Boy, it's dangerous. <laughs> I actually just want to talk about that last week. Honestly, most NCT 127 songs, when they go into the dance break, it's more just the instrumental and then they kind of just dance and you just kind of watch them do yeah. their thing. Yeah. But with this dance break, the reason I love it is like Johnny's line about us being the VIP, like the VIP guest to this party. And then someone's like, let's go, let's go. Like, <laughs> And then there's like, yeah, yeah okay. and then it's there's like, the like and then there's chanting, roll up to the party, roll up, roll up, and I feel like I'm now like rolling up to the party and getting gassed and getting yeah. lit with them. Like most dance breaks in any K-pop song, it's kind of like a spectator sport. Like you're just watching, yeah, you're watching them go them off. Sure. But with this one, I feel like I can actually dance break with them. Like I can actually participate oh, in the me? dance break. I don't know. They do like this weird thing with yeah. their hand, but. The fact that I can even do that move yeah. and actually dance along with them, I actually love that about this dance break. It's like no other dance break I've heard from 127, so I'm here for it. It's my favourite part of the song. These guys are doing too much. I, I want to see them in the studio doing this. Yeah. Like, what happens in your brain that you think I should growl now? <laughs> so, what does that flute sound remind you of? Like, what comes to your mind when you hear well, that? Well, isn't, isn't it like um, like a Pied Piper type thing, like calling you to them? Ooh! Is it not? I like that interpretation, though. <laughs> I mean, I don't love it. In I mean, song. the Pied Piper was a weirdo, but, but I get the idea of, of like calling. Yeah. The fans because like, that's the whole point me. of the song, is it not? That come to me, come, stick we're gonna me. stick close to me, so come to me. I you know what I thought that's the whole point of it. I like that, yeah, because <laughs> that's not what came to my mind. <laughs> What's it? What came to your mind? Um, you know, that meme song of the broken recorder that's playing Titanic's um, My Heart Will Go On. Well, this is elaborate. <laughs> That's what that flute sound reminds really? me of, or like something that would be bumping in like a club in Bikini Bottom in Spongebob No! No! But I, I do understand if people don't like it. I do get it. Mm. It is a jarring sound. Yeah. It's not it's like... It's loud as well. And it's, it's isolated. Loud. Yeah. So I understand. But we had a debate on Discord. Okay. On your Discord. Okay. Everybody join her Discord. It's well, so... Well, join lit. Patreon to join the Discord. Oh, yeah. Okay. Because <laughs> we just want it to be like proper conversations. So that's why it's only through Patreon at the moment. Yeah. But you had it in the spoilers chat. Yeah. So I, I don't know about so it. So a few of us end citizens were getting like really hyped about the song and we were having really in-depth conversations. And um, one of the users called August, she said that I could shout her out. Um, she basically was just saying how she thought it was a piccolo that was playing that weird sound and okay. not a flute. Because Mark and Johnny said it was a flute. So okay. then I doubted myself because I thought it was a recorder and I thought Oh that... my, okay, this is getting really technical. Yeah. I thought that someone was playing the recorder wrong. Like, they uh... don't know how to play the recorder. That's what the sound was reminding you me You felt of. like it was wrong. 
not wrong in the sense of like why is it here yeah. more of the way the person is playing the recorder they don't know how to play the recorder okay, that's yeah. the vibe i was getting from that sound <laughs> Sorry, guys, but that I love it. People but... came and did a whole production. They they layered. They spent days to do something. It passed through levels at SM. It then goes out through the recording company. And you're there like, I think someone didn't know how to play the recorder. That's sorry. <laughs> I played the recorder when I was in year five. And I'm telling you now, when I was playing, that, that's how it was starting. You're a joker. No, but honestly, on a serious note, like, we were debating what wind instrument it was. Because Mark and Johnny are saying it's a flute. August is saying it's a piccolo. And I think she's more right because a piccolo is a half flute, right? Ah. So it gives, like, a... I think it gives, like, a higher sound. Flutes are more smooth than... Yeah, like, possible. this might be a piccolo because that was really sharp and high. There's a whole thing right now really? on Twitter, like so many people like trashing the song. What I will say is this: this happens with every single NCT One Two Seven comeback. Okay, people complain. Sticker is a song I've never heard before. I Ever, actually, actually, yeah, I have nothing to compare. Sticker no, yeah, to. no, you can't. Whereas you can't other compare. songs, I can. But it's not the point. point. Exactly, guys. Isn't that the point? NCT stands for Neo Culture Technology. At the end of the day, you're going to hear you. weird stuff. They told you in the name. <laughs> I don't understand what... what I, I think fans have a right to like and dislike songs. Yeah. But when they start saying, this isn't their sound, or this is something that like they shouldn't have done, or they should have done this, or they shouldn't have done that. Guys, it's a company. Okay, like these people sit down and make these decisions, it's not by accident. So, all you can do is okay, so this doesn't match my understanding of them, I need to reevaluate rather than trying to do it the other way around and like yeah. trying to change how they evaluated it. No, yeah. like we need to work out why they chose sticker, why they chose the flute, why they chose all of those different songs in it. Um. Uh, the sound instruments yeah exactly. and the lyrics and stuff anything we don't understand we need to understand why they chose to do it rather than yeah. being like oh they shouldn't have done that no at the end of the day what does neo mean new <laughs> true so they're gonna do new stuff they're gonna do things wow. like people push are gonna boundaries. get really annoyed <laughs> you're gonna be forever annoyed lemonade Uh, sipping my lemonade. And even the like beats on this. Mm. Oh, so good. I like that it's Hedgehog first as well. Yeah, whenever he introduces a song. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, but the fact that he's the fact that he's rapping. Jayhan is the rapping. The fact that he's guys. rapping. I was just like what? The last time I heard Jacob rap was like Simon Says, so I'm gas now. But it was like good. Yeah. Like, you know, sometimes when like rappers sing, singers rap, you know, like when they do it at that level, you're like, whoa. It's like when Mark sang, I was like, Mark can sing? Yeah. So it's the fact that he can rap like that. And he's good. And he's not even a main rapper. He's on not a, even on the rap line. And in a group where Taeyong and Mark are, he's like, yeah, I'm Holding right. his own. Yeah. 100%. <laughs> and I'm here for it. No, the talent, the talent is there. Should we go back? Okay. These analogies, they really take it to another level. I love Gulp it down. Yeah. Stir it. Before we get into the rap, honestly, this song, when I first saw the track list mm -hmm. and I saw the name Lemonade, I did think it was going to be one of those sexy songs where we're all going to like 
you know, twerk and get lit. But the fact that I'm reading the lyrics and I've like seen like kind of the vibe mm. from the track video, yeah. like they're kind of sending for the haters. But ah, oh, yeah, a gulp it down. Yeah. So literally, like when you read like the lyrics, um, Jay Hun's rap and then He Chan's verse, they're just talking about how oh, you're saying behind your computer, you're typing mm. away, you're anonymous, like, we can't see you. And then, like, when it they're all chanting... It tastes like lemonade. It tastes good. <laughs> yeah, we're drinking your tears like lemonade. <laughs> so, yeah, it's really nice that it actually, like, circumnavigated my expectations because I thought we were going to be twerking. But now we're just sending for the haters and I'm here for gulp it. Gulp it down as well. So gulp it down. Not just taste, like gulp the whole thing. Fire Truck is a song, right? Yeah. Cherry Bomb is the song. Yeah. It's so regular. It's regular. Song? Yeah. Ah. So he's going like the he's whole history. Thing. Oh, of I'm sorry. No, we're doing that again. Run like a. Yeah. spoken lead of nct you're always below my feet yeah Damn. i bet you want to be like me oh now they're sending for all their haters and this is such a good song to follow up sticker because a lot yeah, of people a lot of haters a lot of people were hating on nct for that one well they've got something to tell you lot wow tail is is spicy man Wow. Look, I'm here for it. Send for all the haters. We're here for it. No counterfeit. We cute. We cute. Your voice is noise. I'm sorry, but isn't that what people used to say to them? Yeah. That they're noise. Yeah. And then now Mark Now is, they're saying Mark is like your, your voice, voice is, is noise. noise. <sighs> Mark Lee. Nah, they're sending for them. I like I love it. Mm. But the layers on this part. Yeah. Normally with EXO, they are really good at like someone singing yeah. and then someone's rapping and they're kind of harmonizing mm -hmm. that. NCT don't do it as much, but I'm actually glad they're doing it here because it's showing that one, we have a strong rap line, but we also have vocalists. So don't but play it's also, with us. If the whole scene is about saying something to the haters, that's also a backup. Yeah. It's like, I'm saying it and I've got my crew saying it yeah. with me. So like, sonically. It's also saying the same message, which exactly. I like. And it was what Jiang and and Jongwu, Jongwu, like harmonizing to Mark, right? Because Mark was rapping. Yeah, in the back, but it was more their voices yeah. coming through. They said punch is also a song. Yeah, that's the song I talked about earlier. That people didn't like. <laughs> We ain't never coming down. Yeah, raise your head. Woo! <laughs> You're literally having the best time. Your boys are like. <laughs> Yeah, but his voice is sexy though, even though it's not a sexy song. Yeah. Uh -huh. I just love Mark's ad libs. Uh huh. Uh huh. Look. Just e ending. Wow. Lemonade. I feel like that song. Is perfect for so many reasons. One, 
they're using like an 808 sound where like the bass underneath is kind of going boom 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 mm-hmm. like at the bottom yeah. which is really really reminiscent of like new hip hop mm-hmm. so people that kind of pioneered that sound were like people like Outkast oh okay yeah and Kanye West right so when they kind of came on with that new sound in hip hop people kind of thought it was a bit weird like mm, what's going on here but like hearing that in Lemonade and hearing them doing like a neo hip hop sound it yeah. fits in with their sound of like yeah we're neo but also we do R&B we do hip hop we do all these different genres bring as well all. we're bringing it all together and for Mark to even list all of the songs yeah i love that just I love that because you're not a just history of NCT you're not 127. You're dissing them. You're also like reminding them what we came up with. Yeah, and he's proud of all yeah. of the songs that they've done, like despite what people be. have said. I, mean, I haven't heard them. I'm I mean, sure he should be. I have, <laughs> and I can say there's a lot to be proud of. But um, yeah, it's just nice that he's proud of that and he's saying it with confidence. And then they're all barking and saying "woof." <laughs> <laughs> and then they're saying my crew and it's so cool because you know how like wolves move in packs yeah, yeah, yeah so they're basically like like we're a hard pack like pack, yeah this is our crew our pack like we move together Aww. we're a unit don't mess with us love it i love that and then johnny just in the middle randomly just howling <laughs> like a wolf going oh No, but yeah, I think MVP for that song was definitely Jaehyun. Like, he snapped. No, yeah, no. Yeah, like, definitely. vocally, he was doing a lot. And then he was rapping and his flow was sick. So... No, he came out. He came out and was like, ate. take notice. He ate. And we had up. to. Yeah, Jaehyun. That was your song. Can't lie. Hedgen. Hedgen starts the track again. <laughs> Much more of a like dance beat. Yeah, this is definitely like a house dance track. I can see Shiny doing this. Mm. Ooh, who's doing for fetters? Tail. Tail. I love the little runs he does in the center. Come on. I do feel like their voices are quite low compared to the the beat. Mm. Like it's very like the beat is very strong. Mm. But I don't think maybe this is the point of it. It's not supposed to be overly like sit back and listen to their vocals it's more supposed to be like get yeah it's the vibe yeah exactly. i think with most dance tracks mo- most poppy electro yeah. songs it's more like the beat it's really beat focused but i'm still getting on it a lot of great it. vocals here tell with the runs and the falsetto so I, I mean they're doing it but it's just not being showcased oh, as much okay. as it is in the other two songs oh, okay yeah It's very intense in this picture. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Do you want it again? Yeah. Just love them harmonizing together. Oh, it's like time might come to an end. Yeah. Stay over. Is it cute though? It's a cute vibe. I mean, saying up all night and like, I'm, I'll make you breakfast. Is that about your boys? Look, at the end of the day. <laughs> 
nice and upbeat song. It's cheerful. <laughs> I think you're still in like. <laughs> NCT is cute. Like, there's a bit more to the lyrics. Like, lock me up inside your eyes. You're warm. <laughs> I just don't need people like Taeyong singing that. I have one greed every day, every night, every day. I just don't need who I do. What's the warm? Oh my gosh. But it's him that can do it. Yeah. Oh, I like that. Sunrise welcomes you. Mm -hmm. I feel like that was telling in the background during all sorts of breaking ones. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that is that is ah! tail. That ah! is tail. Oh my gosh, that was tails. Can I take a breath? Hey, you don't have to tell me twice. Take a <laughs> breath. Wow. Wow. Tail. Look, that guy. At the end of the day, NCT just stay winning because they have tail, Doyoung, Hechan, Jaehan, Yuta, Jungwoo. Like. Let us breathe. Like any other group, yeah, would be spoiled if they had just one of those guys in their group in their lineup. It would just be like, you know what, just sing everything. <laughs> I think that I think that's a challenge with them because there's so many and they're so talented. Like you can't focus as much on one. Like and actually, their voices are really unique. Yeah. So then you're constantly like shifting in, into totally different vibes. Even it's with different. A, it's so different. With a heavy beat like that. Yeah. A very electro-driven beat. They're still doing really crazy vocal runs and just like going into falsetto and like yes, even trying tail. to pierce through the beat, which is a lot. It's very busy. I love that. Versus sticker, where the beat was very empty. Yeah. So you could hear their vocals a lot. But this one, it's like, is the beat versus the vocals at this point. <laughs> Yeah, the vocals they're won. For it. They're fighting for it. The vocals won because every time they sang, I caught it. <laughs> I was like, catch, receive. <laughs> I receive. All right, focus. Cool. They are really this like whole neo technology thing. Yeah. Everything is different. Oh, I love that. I just love the way that Hechan sings. Yeah. Like, he just goes down, like, up and down, like, this vocal staircase. Like, he'll just be like, da -da 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 -da, like, with his voice. Yeah. And it's not the beat, it's his vocals. I told you, like, Hechan for me is the, my favorite in, in NCT. So far? Of all of them. All of them. You haven't seen you yet properly. You've yeah. only seen from home. Yeah. But you haven't seen Wavy yet. Well, to be fair, from home, I think Doyoung killed that one. Yeah. But if I'm just saying like, well, I, yeah, fine, I've been in Dream More. But for me, Hetchen's voice is, I haven't seen Wavy at all. We'll see. We'll see, because they have strong We'll, we'll see, lists. but I don't see anyone knocking Hetchen off. I mean, if yeah. Doyoung's not knocking it off for me. Oh, wow, because really? Doyoung's voice is yeah, but, a bit no, of me. His, his voice is amazing, but there's just something about Hetchen's tone that is just different to me entirely. I wonder what other people's opinions are Let of us like, know. voices. Let yeah. us know. Do you have a favourite vocalist? And if you have a reason why, like, so for me it is his tone. I just think, I don't even know how to describe it. No, like, Hetchen's tone is very unique. He comes in and you know it's him. Yeah. It's he, beautiful. I said to you when we were doing Kick It, I don't know if it was in the video or not, but I did say, like, Hechen reminds me of, like, this male Mariah Carey, mm. where he'll okay, just yeah. be doing all sorts with do his runs, voice, yeah. doing all these vocal runs, and, like, I wouldn't be surprised if he can do the whistle tone. I haven't heard it from him yet, but 
Next come back. I hope he Hopefully. pushes himself to go there vocally because I'd be here for it. We don't really hear males go to that octave, but see, we'll see. It's but let us know. Let us it's know what you think. So. Oh, I love the imagery in this lyric. That. Oh, I was so like breathless. Yeah. This all just fits so well together. Okay, Johnny, come oh. in. I was getting ready for him as well. I thought he was just gonna like <laughs> shift the song somewhere. I thought and then Johnny it was, was like, gonna gone. start rapping. And then I was like, oh, okay. It's, it's gone. On to tell. <laughs> Maybe he'll come back because yeah. I can't accept that that's his only line in this. Yeah, 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 no. <laughs> no. That's not okay. I'll fight. <laughs> That run. I love you, Tess. Turn two. They're all doing runs. Who was harmonizing with Utah there? Wasn't it Hetch and starting to come in? No, that's Tail. Mm. That's Tail. Wow. That's Tail. <laughs> All the vocalists are just going crazy here. How did I not notice this guy? Oh, I feel bad. I feel so bad. His voice, man. I'm tired of this couple running to the gym. I'm tired of resisting. I sit on here, thought I was on my top of love. I'm lifting. I'm so glad I'm already. Okay, Johnny. That was like a take notice. Blue light, pull the beach along in North Bay. Can we like give Johnny some lines? It just came and then he went. Oh, he's lying. Jaehyun's voice. He's gone to the next level. It's like R&B, isn't it? He his has voice his voice. Not only is soulful, it's so deep and. I know a lot of them are going like really high oh. and like doing a lot of things up here. But the fact that he's so steady and strong on the lower octaves and he's still he, he doing impressive things. Really. Yeah. Still doing impressive things with a lower tone. I'm here for it because it's giving it bass now. And I'm here for this. Jaehyun, his vocals has improved so much. Like he always was a great singer, but... This comeback so far, he's been snatching every song. What's going on? Wow. I, I can't, I can't com like comment because I've only heard him in a few. So I know him at this standard already. Wow. Lucky me. He won't fall off. He'll keep going up. <laughs> it's just so many lines. Was that Yuta? Yeah. Oh, boy. <laughs> Come and get your boy. I want to play with you more. <laughs> to do what? What do you think he's doing? Can you call? What's going on? What happened to Mark? Look, what? I'm gonna... Guys, what actually happened to Mark? I'm gonna report Mark to his mum and dad. 
Okay, I'm doing it because enough is enough. Mark has been getting so cheeky since the hot it's sauce come, come yeah, back. Yeah, that's what it was. I've been watching it. He shifted something in his brain and he was like, oh, I can do sexy. Okay. No, Mark's always had those moments where he would be cheeky here and there. Like he could do it. But the, this year he said, I'm grown now, consistent. so I'm going to be consistent with it. I want, I want to, to play, play with you more. Oh my God. Pushing everything aside. No, like, it doesn't feel right, Mark saying it. It doesn't. This is like a Taeyong, Johnny, Utah, Even Jayon. Jayon. Yeah. It's that group. It's not Mark. It's not a Mark lyric. He's doing it. But I'm just, I'm, I'm yeah. trying to get my head around him saying that. Since Hot Sauce, Mark's been misbehaving. So at this point, all the lyrics I've been seeing from Mark, he don't care again. He's just right. He said, oh, you think I'm church opera? Well, no. <laughs> I've got a few things to say. everything at this point how many songs have we done and it's just every word the way he says tagging the way he says sticker the way he said lemonade and now the way he said chill so chill and then do you wanna do with you johnny wanna? Yeah. do you wanna <laughs> this is wild i can't they're doing too much if i'm gonna compare it to breakfast I feel like breakfast, maybe because it was so heavily produced, I didn't get to enjoy it as much. Is it what, breakfast? the vocals? Yeah. Like, just the whole song. I just feel like this, focus. I can actually focus on them. Everything flows. When a new person comes in, okay, I can recognise that it's a new person, but it all flows together. And they're Whereas, singing long enough for you to really appreciate yeah, different just, things they're just, doing with their voices. Mate, it's just puts me into like a comfortable state whereas sticker obviously i'm not comfortable but i don't think that's not that's not the point yeah. like sticker is like stand it's up a, and take notice a, yeah it's yeah? a turn up song so i get that lemonade obviously stand up and take notice breakfast i'm not a fan really you no. don't like breakfast no oh i like breakfast i think i was on the edge and then after i heard this <laughs> i was like no okay yeah Okay. I'm, not, I, get I'm not, I don't think I'm a fan. But it's 11 songs. Like, I can't be a fan of everything. I hope you guys understand. No, it's fair. Like, for me, listening to the album, it's a no-skip album for me, personally. I think this is their strongest album. So, Breakfast, I do enjoy. Mm. But vocally, they're doing more with their voices in Focus. It just flows. I just like the flow of this a lot more. Yeah, that, it's... It, flows period there's yeah. no jolt there's no sudden yeah, yeah. movement yeah. the instrumental uh, is basically mm. the same and everyone's everyone's bringing their a game yeah they're I doing all it. sorts of things they're doing kind of whisper tones they're going into falsetto they're doing a lot of vocal run runs they're going into different octaves mm. they're doing a lot and showcasing a lot with the what 20 seconds they're given and they're using it well so Proud. Ooh. It's gonna be emotional. Look, it wouldn't be an NCT album if there wasn't a ballad. <laughs> oh. oh, someone's broken up. No. <laughs> My heart goes back one space. Like I want to, I want to go back into the past. Ah, uh, it's like they're in denial about the breakup. Yeah. Is it definitely a breakup? It could just be. Did yeah, they say they're, I? They're sounding sound. They're, they're sounding sad. So because it's so poetic, they're not actually saying. But they haven't said I missed you. 
Or I want you back or anything. Yeah, it could be anything. So we can't say goodbye. Oh, I wasn't <laughs> oh, okay. Let's go back. Oh, like how can you look at lyrics and listen to that? It's just so. <sighs> I just wanted to vindicate that it was a breakup <laughs> I'm just waiting for it like yeah it's a breakup song yeah but um yeah it's one of those songs where you're really getting yeah. drifted away I want to be carried away start like, like not again but like come on tomorrow's me I can't face it today It's all going in circles. Oh, man! Oh, I'm sorry, but the, the imagery. The poetry. Yeah, the imagery here. I'm Sad actually... Sad memories seep into the gaps of my heart. I'm you can, like, it picture out. it trickling. Yeah, I'm playing out the sadness wow. in my brain with the imagery they're giving me it's right now. It's poetic. Very. I'm really... In denial. Is that a violin? Yeah, the strings here. In the back. And violins are usually quite like. Yeah, they give that sad vibe. Yeah. And even the piano, the way the mm. piano is playing as well, is very dramatically. Oh, I'm being selfish by waiting. Like, I should let you go. Oh, hey, they broke oh, up! Oh <laughs> Diane? No, I'm just looking at these lyrics. Some songs you have to listen to it with the lyrics. This song has taken a whole new meaning for me now. Why? Because I just listened to it without the lyrics. And now I'm looking, like, it's saying, like, fall like rain, like, blow like, like the wind. Cries. Like, the cries are falling <gasps> like rain. That is actually and the wind is, like, a bit unstable. No, this is making the song yeah. more sad. The po poetry in it is, like, excellent. Yeah. Whoever wrote this, like, A, 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 A star. Poet. Yeah, it's so good. Yeah, Shakespeare's shaking. It's actually like, sorry. <laughs> it yeah. is. It's so good. And then obviously they do it justice, but they have a base for it to be able to interpret it that way with their voices. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. Maybe this has knocked off focus. Oh my gosh, so each song is just gonna knock off the, the next one. That's how it's going. Sign of a good album. Yeah, the piano is making it more sad. <laughs> oh, and then the low note! No, I'm sorry, can we go back? Wait, here. It's been played, and then I think it stops, and then the low note. So, Just and that to, low note And to well. me, that is the whole lingering, I can't wait. Like, I, I can't stop. 
What, so, that last note? Yeah, so like everything that they've been saying, I don't want to let go, but I have to. They're playing the note, they stop, and then the lone note, yeah. because they can't let go. But now they're alone. Yeah! Ha <laughs> ha! Sorry. Levels. There's levels to this. Levels. Okay? Oh! Don't just listen to the song of think, oh, bop! Levels. Wow, there's levels. There's levels to this. That is the sign of good artistry. Yeah, no, it's art. Guys, who said NCT is just noise music? What idiots. Oh. Oh, I love that. I love that. Yeah. Fuck. I love this song. Fashion Disney. Do what you want. <laughs> No, just that. Ah, I love that to his bro. Yeah. That. Oh, I'll take it. Hard carries. I'll take it on to you, isn't it? His voice is different in this, isn't it? Yeah, Utah. Okay, Utah snapping on this. The way he pronounces words. Yeah. For me. He like so he's versatile. Like Roger there, and then he's just coming in with all this with the rap. Okay. I didn't register his rap. It's kind of like a rap song. Who has shown with the rap sing to? <laughs> I don't get that though. What was the na 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 for? Did they do it often? I haven't seen it. NCT. Really? Very many variations of na. Really? Na. I don't even want to hum all the different nas I know. Oh, okay. Because okay. you haven't heard all the no, songs. Yeah, but. You know, and citizens, you know, we've heard Nana in very many variations. <laughs> well, I mean, it's call and response, isn't it? And it's something yeah. that fans can chant, it, even if they don't know English. And I like, do... Even if they don't know the language. You can, yeah. Anyone you can, can say, nah, 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 nah. Yeah, yeah, it's true. So it makes sense that you would put that I in. I didn't feel Just I haven't song. seen it. <laughs> well, but that's, that's my thing. Like, NCT, from what I know of them, they don't need to fill up songs. Look at this. But I know, but they I know need to. most songwriters, sometimes when they want to fill up a song, they do put no, a little no. da-da-da, na-na-na. I get it, but you're right. La, la, la. If you know you're writing for NCT, unless they don't know, if you know you're writing for NCT, look at these men. You don't need to, you don't need na na Like, <sighs> let them fill it up themselves. You know Ad-libs. What? They can do ad-libs to fill that section up. At the end of the day, na is a vibe too. Yeah, I'm not into it. Okay, let's hear the number. I'm into them. <laughs> let's just hear if it's actually Guys, vibe. let me know. <laughs> I might just be overly overly critical. I'm not into it. What, but I like know? it's because I like words. You know, I'm really into like yeah. words and lyrics and messages. Yeah. So that's probably why. Like Fair things enough. that don't have a message on like Original. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> oh my god. on fire. Mark Lee. At this point, I think he's the MVP when it comes to ad libs. A hundred percent. His ad libs actually are so lit. 
Go nuts! Yeah, that was Hetch Chung doing the ad libs there. Nice. Oh, Johnny come in with that now. perform this he's just gonna appear isn't he he should it's only fitting coming in hard, going off, going high, and doing it for a long period of time. Like you're gonna cry. <laughs> nah, his voice stresses me out. It's so good. <sighs> at the top, he runs. Oh my God. He's doing runs at the top. Doing it again. <laughs> nah, I need to hear that again. <laughs> Like a supporting, because it's to show, like, yeah, just doing it. I'm getting tired of Tail at this point because not only is he just doing that for fun as an ad lib, it's not even his part. <laughs> see constellations <laughs> maybe that's why they haven't done a music video <laughs> that was like, we're not paying for that they bring up money all the time they can bring up the money for that okay thank you so much i've already put it out there you don't even have to work hard for this now the concept is laid out stars orbits planets rocket someone coming out of the rocket the end <laughs> 